what is a lineo in, 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 in our terminology, it's, a, it's, it's part of a lineage. It's the source and transformation part of a lineage without the target. Uh, it is also another way to document a technical definition. All right, so this, for those of you who are not data cookbook clients, uh, you maybe don't have a lot of exposure to it, but in the data dictionary, we have functional definitions and then de technical definitions. And the functional definition might be formatted name and then it was some English language description the formatted name is first name and last name and a comma, blah, 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 blah. And then um, the technical definition says it, you can have multiple per system. So I've got one for um, Banner and for my uh, CRM and all, and wherever I'm pulling data from. Uh, and the technical definition is how you, it's, it's a narrative place where you can fill in how you pull that, how you pull that data to match the definition. So, you know, it might be select, you know, with some sort of concatenated value, or you might in English write out what it is, or you might explain that there's some procedure you call, right? Alineo is a version of that that's more spec-based, right? So here's this example. So you might have a technical definition, and I think this is for, this is also for admit term, where it says, you know, pull the term code entry for any student, blah, 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 blah. That's a narrative version. And then Alineo is what we saw here, where it's pulling from these two, you know, the admit code and the term code and going through this function. And I, this is a screenshot sort of doesn't show the hover over that happens here. But notice there's no target here. So this is just, you know, if, if I'm putting any, if, if it's used on a report, it's going to come out that way. If it's going to be dropped into some other mapping, it'll, it'll, it'll show. So it's just, it, it, and you can do one or the other or both of these uh, to, and, they, and they should sort of represent the same thing or they could augment each other in terms of documentation. But having a lineo sort of helps you um, have a, a more spec-based reusable portion of your of your um, technical definitions and helps to build up the lineage.